Welcome to the About Color Model video tutorial, created to provide you basics about color models usage, within Tunes Harlequin. For this tutorial we are going to use BTLV, that is the cleaned up and unfilled character level, and BPTLV, that is the filled up character level. Both levels are stored into Tunes traditional workflow, tutorial material inside the cleaned up drawings, folder, and color model TIFF, that is the reference image for color extraction. It is stored inside Tunes traditional workflow, tutorial material, and inside the color models folder. Let's begin loading the BTLV in our current scene, using the drag and drop. Color models can be used to automatically define palette styles and paint the animation level. To load the color model for the BTLV animation level, we have to select any sheet cell where the BTLV level is exposed. In the built added room, right click in the color model viewer and choose load color model from the menu that opens. In the browser that opens, load the color model TIF image. You can find in the Tunes traditional workflow, tutorial material, and inside the color models folder. In the dialog that opens, choose to overwrite the destination palette. The palette of the BTLV level will be replaced by the palette extracted from the color model. If the color model is a full color image, like the current one, or animation level. The palette is automatically generated by extracting colors from the image or the first image of the level. If the full color image contains many shaded colors, the palette will be optimized to reduce the number of colors. Best results can be achieved by preparing models painted with flat colors and whose outline has no anti-alias like we have done here. Note that the color model can also be panned and zoomed in or out, by using standard shortcuts. Let's see now, what happens if the color model is a Tunes raster or vector level, TLV or PLI file. As you can see it already comes with a palette, whose style names and page configuration will be preserved, when the destination palette will be overwritten. The color model can be used not only as a visual reference, but also for picking styles with no need to retrieve styles in the palette, or to use the style picker tool. Now, I'm going to use the color model to fill the first drawing of the BTLV level. So, I have to select the fill tool, set the fill type to normal, and the mode to areas. In the color model, click the area whose style you want to pick, so that the style is automatically selected. Click in the drawing area you want to fill and go on, until the first drawing is completely painted. Remember to activate the view, transparency check, to make sure all of the drawings areas, are properly painted. This check displays all of the painted areas in grey, all of the lines in black, and the background in white. Thanks for your attention, and see you on the next video tutorial.